Ladies and gentlemen, finally, the cash stash controversy that has hit the Congress is the biggest cash scandal to hit India. It is really embarrassing. As of this minute, the count exceeds 350 crore rupees. It's a Vadra Congress MP. The money can either be for the MP himself or for the party. Ladies and gentlemen, the party is not taking action against the MP. What does that indicate? Read for yourself. Let's debate. After five days of operation, the IT department has accounted that Rs 351 crore cash was found in raids linked to Congress MP, making it the biggest ever cash haul in India. झारखंड में किसी एमपी के यहाँ मैं किस दल के हैं कहना नहीं चाहता पूरी दुनिया जानती हैं इतनी सारी कैश मिली कि बैंक के कैशियर कहते हैं हमने भी इतनी कैश कभी देखी नहीं है गिनते गिनते पांच दिन हो गए सताईस मशीनें गर्म हो गई मानने वाले गर्म हो गई मशीनें बंद हो गई मगर अभी समाप्त नहीं होता है और एक भी एक भी एक गवर्नमेंट या गठबंधन ने इसकी टीका भी नहीं की है उसको सस्पेंड भी नहीं बीजेपी इज गोइंग ऑल आउट टॉप लीडर्स प्रोटेस्टेड इन पार्लियामेंट अगेंस्ट करप्शन जो झारखंड के कांग्रेस के सांसद धीरज साहू के ठिकानों से जिस तरीके से पैसे निकल रहे हैं नोटों की गड्डियां निकल रही हैं आप सब लोगों ने तस्वीरों में ये देखा है भ्रष्टाचार का पैसा गरीबों का पैसा मेहनत कश लोगों का पैसा जो चूस करके इन कांग्रेसियों ने इकट्ठा किया है उसका जीता जागता प्रमाण बट कांग्रेस इज येट टू टेक एक्शन अगेंस्ट इट्स एम पी हु इज ऑन द स्कैनर नथिंग डू विथ कांग्रेस पार्टी एट ऑल Neeraj Sahu MP has to explain what happened there, why this much money is seized from his house. That has to be explained by himself. Parties not associated with this type of things at all. Fight against corruption has undoubtedly become the number one issue this election season. Let's debate. Hundred and seventy-six currency bags of pure hard cash, Lokesh Jindal. Uh, why is the Congress not sacked this man? Are you proud of him, or was the money for the party? Was he collecting the money for the party to be used in the election? Are you scared of taking action against him? Can't hear you. Can you unmute yourself, please? I am unmuted. Can you hear me now? Am I audible? I can't hear you. Loud. Hello. Yeah, hello. No, am I audible now? Yeah. Arnab, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Arnab, we have seen yeah. that there were there are various instances where we have family members yes, yes, I... of BJP leaders. indulging into certain criminal activities anti social activities now can we hold the political party responsible for it both distillery private limited in its private capacity indulged into tax evasion and hoarded cash and over here this was done in their personal capacity the party has nothing to do with whatever is being claimed by bjp i think this is only very petty politics that is being played on this issue the question should be asked by the it officials to the airing company to whose uh, majority of the cash was found in both distillery private limited i think the accounts must be audited penalty must be imposed and strict action as per the income tax act must be taken <coughs> against those who are uh, who are guilty now why yeah, is this I mean, being linked no, no. to polit- to indian national congress i don't understand I think now Lokesh uh, has had his say. Let me come in. 
whose money was is... was the raid carried out by cbi it was carried out by the income tax officials MP. because he's your no. mp no or not had the raid been carried by the cbi whereby some illegal gratification or some political bribery or corruption would have taken like what happened in karnataka where 8 crore was demanded by an mla son now this was something which was a political illegal gratification that was being being uh, demanded now over here cbi comes into action you would have all the rights i mean called the party you would have to answer you can't have a face to face you don't allow so the other panelists to speak this can't be a middle of one person what kind of a debate is this you know let the bjp put its point of view across please allow me to answer allow Lokesh, me to you, answer you've been speaking you non stop for the last 5 minutes you've been time. speaking non stop for the last 5 minutes sanju uh, one minute yes, one sir, minute I'm... one minute one minute there is a delay here sanju one minute please sanju one minute please uh lokesh there's a delay here sanju just one minute please uh point being i'm just letting the people see the visual sanju they need to see the visuals lokesh wait a minute in case you missed it before sanju's rebuts this there is only one simple point there's an mp called thiraj sahu right and baud can i run the visuals please baud distillery private limited they are known for excise in orissa he is in this business for 40 years this is a liquor business concentrated in areas of western districts of baud bolangir sambalpur besides the southern district of raigarh why am i showing the pictures because this is 353 crores viewers the machines which count the money have broken down but there is still more and more money more and more money being found you have not given now, bjp the i believe to speak. that the congress must tell us how can it come and say the money is being collected by this mp in a personal capacity how can you May say that the money is, is being collected in a the director of both distillery private limited argument of robert wadra no, being repeated all over again okay, no, 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 i want to ask a question is bhiran sahu director of both distillery private limited money is collected by the individual in a personal capacity louder please i can't hear either in the studio no arnab my question <coughs> is sanju please don't do these things like sanju sahu and all that in the middle of the debate it's unnecessary and inappropriate please thank you one yes. minute please arnab, i think my, my point i'll continue the debate if required like this but i will not have a i will not have a video put off and all that in the middle of the debate i'll go back to the debate i'm telling you sanju that's bad form i'm going back to the visuals i will not allow any individual to feel so peeved hearing the other side or my please description of the facts if you switch off the video and all team. please don't or do no, that please. continue with your There's response a thank you problem with your team don't be peeved at me you should be peeved at your technical team why are you getting peeved at me i can barely hear what you're saying i think you guys have shifted to my, new pcr this is not the first time sanju no, is, my, my, know, my, te- my, my technical team does I'm not manage the video of please your zoom not, link please do not at least don't my technical team does not I manage do that. my I technical team does not manage me. the video of your link please stop admonishing please, me please please sanju you've not done this for the first time i am i am compelled to tell you to do this please don't do this all right no let me have my say I am no, no, I'm just you, telling you, you that in the course of a debate I do not expect anyone don't teach me don't no, teach me again you're overstepping you again you're overstepping in the course of the debate kindly don't yes, do this kindly don't do this including you this is the third or fourth time, time that you are doing it and I am telling you not to do it can i come yeah, don't do it for the third or fourth time in the course of one yeah, hour I, i will show you please. the recording of what you've done and i am telling you right here right now sanju yeah, varma that please don't do this do the fourth or fifth time that you make comments on the yeah, nature I of a debate on the nature of the anchor what kind of a show does a person host and things like that are not going to be accepted by me I don't need you to please take don't do that some things yeah, no i also please. don't lead lessons in what you are doing yeah, so and i believe now. that you are overstepping and it is not necessary for you to do that you can yeah, throw I any kind of tantrum but i will tell you it's inappropriate yeah, you can now. say that I any number not, of times but I'm please don't do it now please continue no goswami thank you yes you don't need lessons from me i don't need lessons from you or not now let me speak first and foremost sanju i do not appreciate your tone you please don't use that tone with me because i don't use that tone with you i am telling you something that you should not do i feel yes, that your tone is often inappropriate and i am placing it on record yeah, don't get arrogant with me 
Don't I show me I your arrogance on television, Sanju. It is not necessary. And I will not take it. I will not take it. Thank you. I will not take it. Yes, don't take it, but let me make I will not take it. I constantly cannot hear your arrogant tone being used unnecessarily throughout the course of the debate. Thank you. Dheeraj Sahu or not, Dheeraj Sahu was denied. Dheeraj Sahu did not win from Lok Sabha. And in order to compensate the fact that he lost Lok Sabha elections twice, Dheeraj Sahu was made a Rajya Sabha MP by the Congress thrice. Now, Jairam Ramesh puts out a tweet saying that we don't know who is Dheeraj Sahu. If you don't know who is Dheeraj Sahu, how on earth did the Congress make Dheeraj Sahu a three-time MP from Rajya Sabha since 2009-10? That is point number one. Point number two, Bob Distillery, which is Dheeraj Sahu's company, has shown that it is making losses. A company which says, I am making losses in my balance sheet and profit and loss statement. How on earth has it managed to get 300 or 400 or 500 or 1000 crores? Point number three, people say, oh, Dheeraj Sahu is a great businessman. If Dheeraj Sahu is a great businessman, my limited point is, his last income tax return shows he had an income of 1 crore. He had a liability due to a loan of 2.38 crore. By that logic, I fail to understand how he has amassed hundreds of crores. Point number four, forget Dheeraj Sahu. Sanju Verma is Dheeraj Sahu's Sahu, brother, director of Bob Gopal Distillery Sahu Private Limited. also fought Lok Sabha 2019 elections on a Congress ticket. Tell me, Lokesh, Can why Dheeraj Sahu's brother fight Lok Sabha elections Sahu on Congress ticket in 2019? Is Dheeraj Sahu director of Bob Distillery Private Limited? I just said you don't know who is Gopal Sahu. Gopal Sahu is a Congress leader. Dheeraj Sahu's brother Rajeshwar Sahu is a Congress leader. Dheeraj Sahu himself is a Congress leader. Sanju Verma, can I ask you a question? Is Dheeraj Sahu director in the Bob Distillery Private Limited? Sanju, what's your problem? Dheeraj Sahu, Kumpani Rahul, Sanju Ji, Bharat Jodo Yatra. Sanju Ji, is Dheeraj Sahu director in the Bob Distillery Private Limited? Answer this question first. Is he a director in the Bob Distillery Private Limited? Is he a shareholder? Congress MP, yes or no? Is Dheeraj Sahu a Congress MP? No, no, no. Yahaan par baat Bob Distillery Private Limited ki ho rhi hai, jahaan se hi cash mila hai. Is Dheeraj Sahu director in Bob Distillery Private Limited? Aapke paas FIR ki copy hai. Is Dheeraj Sahu a Congress MP, yes or no? He is a Congress MP, but please tell me, has he been caught with corruption, political corruption? Rajeshwar Sahu, a Congress leader, yes or no? The issue is revolving around Bob Distillery Private Limited. We must stick to the topic. My question is, is Dheeraj Sahu a director in Bob Distillery Private Limited? We have nothing to do with Dheeraj Sahu or his brothers. No, I I I am asking you. I uh one minute, one minute, one minute. Uh Lokesh, Lokesh. Lokesh, Lokesh. You are still gratifying them. Lokesh, Lokesh, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute. Uh Sanju, one minute. One minute, Sanju, one minute, one minute. The 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 person who has been found guilty of 350, 360 crores of black money is a Congress member of Parliament. If you disagree with what he has done, what action have you taken against him? Yes. You're taking the Anup, same approach that you all, towards Suresh uh, Kalmadi. Uh, Please understand, Lokesh. Towards Suresh no, Kalmadi, you started Kalmadi by saying comparing... that this is individual corruption. One minute. One minute, please. I have not finished. Lokesh, I have not finished. I have not finished. I have not finished, Lokesh, I told you. I have not finished. Right. Fact is, you people say, where is the black money being brought from abroad? Are bhai, the black money is inside your house. <laughs> This money is not white money, no? It's black money. It's hard cash. Your party is so scared to even take action against this member of parliament, I suspect was the money being collected for the ICC. Was he collecting the money on behalf of the ICC? How do I know where the money was meant for? Certainly not any other shareholders or bought distilleries. Arnab, let us talk about facts. I mean, we shooting uh, in the air is not going to make uh, give us any outcome. First of all, when I'm talking about this entire incident, 
you see that there was large cash that was found the raid was conducted by the it department and they are breaking you cannot compare this i am talking facts only mr kalmadi you cannot compare this case to that of mr kalmadi this is the clear cut case of tax evasion that i can i can and i will did you blame the bjp yes or no when cash was found from bjp leader mother vinod shappa's house you blame the bjp am i am i allowed to put my point without any interruption no it is very difficult to come out with to speak our mind out with such a form of constant interruption arna please virupak shappa's house but you said dheeraj sahu ke liye congress ko hame blame nahi karna chahiye do 100000s of Arna, I just need few seconds of uninterrupted time so that I can clearly put my views forward. This is like Trinamool Congress trying to protect Partha Chatterjee. Arna, this is like Trin. No, you tell me, Lokesh, 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 is this also political vendetta? Because for every raid of IT and ED and CBI, you say it's political vendetta. Leave it aside. In this case, is it political vendetta? is this Absolutely also not. political Arna, vendetta is this also a false charge is this also make believe is there a congress ah, so it's not here right but here but if you act against ajl and rahul gandhi it's political vendetta if you act against a member of parliament it's not private limited located why don't you allow the it officials to carry out the entire investigation and thereby come out with the conclusion and levy a penalty and fine and in the court of law yatra and are you still denying this for my please madam madam have some minimum courtesy to at least hear your court panelists to se kanda mila ko chalne ko yatra mein ghoom rahe the this form of behavior rahul gandhi what are we doing we are only making noise we are not making sense at all you tell me dheeraj sahu a congress mp yes or no iska jawab do lokesh don't indulge in what about me is dheeraj sahu a rajya sabha mp from the congress yes or no is gopal sahu did he fight lok sabha election on congress ticket yes or no is dheeraj sahu's brother rajeshwar sahu a senior congress leader mai baat suniye mai yahan par na ochi debate karne nahi aaya hu mai ladne nahi aaya hu yahan par we are going to debate and discuss nahi nahi aap lokesh lokesh this one i i think i think you can avoid the answers but you can avoid the answers but this is a talking point because the pictures don't lie and i will once again end with the visuals ladies and gentlemen you remember when the trinamool congress first started defending partha chatterjee after the cash haul at that point of time for for a period of time trinamool congress said no no these are make believe charges eventually even the trinamool congress when the pictures were out and i want the pictures to be full frame at the end of the program the trinamool congress said no no there's nothing this is not a person who we can defend and they were forced to take some action ladies and gentlemen how is it that the congress party in this case is not being able to gather itself even the basic guts to take action against this mp that makes it extremely suspicious so much money in the hands of one mp of the congress party imagine imagine ladies and gentlemen how much money this party could have collected directly or indirectly if such money goes account unaccounted and if sonia gandhi and rahul gandhi don't take action what will you ask ladies and gentlemen see you tomorrow at 9 pm on the debate till tomorrow evening good night and goodbye